Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we actually have at least the start of a brand new week going on over here for the PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X restocks. We at least do have a few little more of a higher, I think, uptick of locations in stock and other things going on. We have some locations that are on the overdue side. We have a lot of locations that are kind of used to on the Monday drops. And just a bunch of little other various things too as well all throughout the day. So hopefully you guys will sit tight, relax, and enjoy. And as well, make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc, digital console controller, Twitter and Twitch room down below, the Weeble and Coinbase down below, the little Twitter giveaway down below, and as well we'll also have the weekly video too up as well in a few hours, so anything that's kind of like happens before then or between that, we have at least a chance to give you guys the heads up on. So uh, let's go and just talk about a bunch of random stuff from the weekend, from onwards and all of that. So if any of you guys are brand new, first and foremost, we actually did go and see a little bit more on the Target side. So, if you guys had a chance to go and see, I'd still probably recommend just checking out for some stock throughout the day. But a few things to note. Number one is that Target does seem to be doing a little bit more of just in-store restock. So, think more of like proper like console physically on the shelf. You just walk in, you're checking out like the, the toiletries, you're looking at the food, you're trying to get a plate. And then you also look in the tech center, there's a PlayStation 5 sin there. So... That we have been seeing at least a little bit more of an uptake of stores having stock available. So if you guys want to go and if you guys are casually checking your Target stores or looking around or whatever, you guys can be on the lookout for that if you guys would want. So first and foremost, that's kind of nice. <laughs> Although it is sporadic, as I'm sure you guys know, but we have been seeing a little bit more of an uptick and kind of more of the start, I think, of some Target actually getting some stock in stores. So if you guys want to casually check, we did see a pretty big batch of stock arrivals as of like last week. So we'll probably be seeing a lot more of a distribution from the warehouses showing up in the stores and locations and just, you know, employees confirming stock and everything else all tied together. So we're going to be watching that and seeing that. So if you guys want to go, if you guys are just casually there, feel free to go and call your stores or whatever. You guys can ask around and see. We have been seeing a lot more employees as well being kind of nicer, where if you just want to be like, hey, Jim, like from tech, like I heard that there's been a lot more walk-ins. When was your last batch? Do you happen to know when the next batch is coming? Should I check like this week, next week? And we've been seeing a lot more folks kind of again just being like more on the more on the chill side. Like we're kind of pretty deep in this. We're like, what, 19 months into this or something. So we've just been seeing a lot more folks that are kind of just like, yeah, we got you. Like check here or come here or go here or do whatever. So all around been looking pretty nice. Now, as a reminder, because we have been seeing a larger uptick of stock showing up, go and check on the online side as well. Now, throughout this weekend, we actually didn't see that that much of normal like locations and regional locations getting target stock. But if you guys want to, usually Mondays onwards and before, it always used to be Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. So when it comes to with all that stock, just be on the lookout for it in case you guys would like. But... Uh, we've been still looking around the 7 a.m. to around the 10 a.m. range, literally like right now. You guys want to go check your app, check online, check your local 50-mile radius, and go from there. So that's kind of a big thing to kind of note that I think Target will be a big focus, I think especially throughout this week, mainly because we saw a lot of warehousing locations having stock. It's around like that three- to four-week cycle period where usually stock has been showing up in stores and being available and all of that. So it should be looking nice and should be looking spicy throughout this, especially for today. I just want to check and see, but also throughout the week. We'll talk about that in the weekly video as well. So on top of that, too, besides like Target Walkins and stuff like that, Best Buy. Now, we have been talking a lot about Best Buy. We just haven't seen anything happen yet. Like a lot of these locations, I'm sure you guys know, we just haven't been seeing stuff going on. It's been kind of annoying. But Best Buy, we have been seeing Best Buy store in stock. So if you guys want to keep checking and seeing with that one, you guys totally can. Be on the lookout for it in case you guys would like. And as well, uh, just keep checking we have been seeing the best buy both on the line for overdue we also have seen warehouse movement too as well so we know that's kind of coming and on top of that we're just waiting for stock <laughs> like just, i just want this job to happen we always do mention that notoriously total tech mondays although there's only ever been like four total i be a little bit more on the extra for the day as of today. So be on the lookout. We are on the overdue for total tech. I wouldn't be that surprised seeing one still or just a proper online drop. We do keep on mentioning that Best Buy does have the online side. So just be on the lookout for that in case you guys would want to. But we've been kind of just closely waiting for that. So in stores, check your Best Buy app. Uh, give them a call either or show up at like location depending. If it does have the unavailable or out of stock, you guys can go and check and see from stock with there. So, uh, well, yeah, <laughs> Best Buy should be looking still pretty good. We'll be on looking for like a Monday drop throughout the day. We have, we've seen Best Buy do drops on every day, although usually Mondays, Wednesday, Thursday, Fridays are a more bigger set. I mean, they've also done Tuesday drops too. I'm sure you guys have heard. So with this, all the other things going on as well. Uh, we also have been seeing a lot of walk-ins. So I'm sure you guys have probably heard. 
Uh, Myers has had a pretty good weekend so far for stocks. So if you guys want to keep checking and seeing, it just we keep on seeing it kind of sprinkled everywhere. We're seeing some in like Illinois now, finally. We're probably expecting more in like Indiana and Ohio. We've been seeing a lot of Wisconsin and Michigan. So just keep on checking your stores. Give them a call and go from there. These are just normal playing consoles, no bundles required. All around some nice and good juicy stuff. Like we we like it. We like the good good. We like it. So that's um my number one big thing there. Now, too, as well, when it comes to Xboxes, apparently we've also been seeing a few Xboxes showing up in Meyer stores, so go from there. Xbox side, too, Target's been kind of dry, and same with Best Buy. Both of them have actually been a little bit more on the quieter side, so we'll maybe be waiting to see if there's, like, another additional stock relaunch or someone else with it, so we can be on the lookout for that. Uh, Amazon, too, as well. We are slowly now getting to the overdue side. Like, I'll probably talk about this a little bit more in the weekly video. I would say probably not this week slash this next week. It's always been the lookout, though. Uh, you know, we always got the links, you know, it's always down below. Xboxes are overdue, so we'll probably just wait until we see, like, a big, huge batch of everything. In all honesty, I can maybe even see the Xbox Series X being full, mostly done. Where we have, like, the next big Walmart, Best Buy, Amazon Wave. Like, what, all, like, one more good cycle, and we might be, like, pretty much good. Depending on, like, everything else. But, basically, Xbox is very overdue for Amazon. Would not be that surprising them soon. PlayStation's not as much overdue. PS5 Digital's not as much overdue. But we'll be on the lookout for it. Now, as always, we're going to be waiting to see if GameStop might go and work in a clutch little Tuesday restock. So if we do, I'll have a, you know, a nice confirmed video later on throughout the day if we can. But basically, GameStop has been notorious for Tuesdays. They haven't done a drop, at least online, a little while. So we're going to be kind of just casually waiting and seeing and kind of going from there. So we'll see if they you know, have any Facebook messages or tweets or confirm it up. We'll let you guys know. Although they kind of have been focusing a little bit more, I think, on the walk-in side. And then as well, Walmart, although we haven't really seen too many Monday drops, they have on occasion done, like, YOLO drops on Monday. We're just waiting for more information on that. So I think today is usually for Mondays, big information days. That's why I do the weekly video, too, as well. Let's be on the lookout for that. But uh, we'll be waiting to see if Best Buy uh, does anything good stuff or more stock. Same with Target. If we see more stock, either or. And then GameStop for tweets and messages. Like, we'll kind of go and see. Now, as well with the PS Direct. We have mentioned before, and we usually have seen a lot of Monday, Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, PS Directs throughout the weeks. So we'll wait to see if there's maybe any emails that get sent in out for us to go pick up stock and go from there. Or as well, part two, if there actually is just going to be a proper like public drop. So if you just want to follow the Twitter, follow the, like, you know, subscribe. We'll put our notifications on for community posts if we see a PS Direct. So uh, kind of go from there. We'll kind of watch and go and see. So at least we're all watching that. We know the stock is loaded. Same with Best Buy. We're just kind of patiently waiting for them to get stock. Right now, I almost kind of feel like maybe... Uh, Maybe Sony's just been kind of like some stock issues or trying to build up a big stock or trying to make other regions all good for a while before America gets stock. So we're kind of just waiting for that. Now, for some other little things too, guys, don't forget Anton Line. Anton Line was kind of pushing and chilling some Xboxes quite a bit throughout this past week. So PlayStation's very, very overdue on the both the PS5 disc side and PS5 digital side. So especially throughout today, we're going to be watching them. They do sometimes start off weeks, especially after a prior kind of mediocre week of getting additional extra stock. Costco, we actually have been hearing more on the opening side. We made a video on that yesterday, so if we see more stock movement with that one, I'll let well, you guys know, but we could also be on the lookout throughout this week for some Costco PS5 drops or even today for the next few hours. Sam's Club hasn't usually done too, too much on the Monday side, so we're probably not expecting too, too much from them. Newegg always be on the lookout for their day-to-day -day shuffles going on. Uh, we'll also have the game Fly as well. They're both just on the overdue side for both PS5 bundles and Xbox Series X bundles on both sides. So we're just kind of watching and waiting for all that good, juicy stuff over there. So good stuff as we're watching for all that. Now for the little various things too as well, we have not been seeing too many more BJ's wholesalers doing any more walk-ins. If we see more stuff, we'll let you guys go and know. Uh, same with all the other various mid-tier places, like Indorma did do a restock last week. Probably one of the only restocks last week, so probably not going to be on the throughout the drops throughout the day. Uh, all the other various places, too, might be a little bit more on the chiller side, because Mondays are more on the layback side. Uh, as well for other walk-ins, too, such as Military. Military Online is very overdue for stock and restocks. Same with in-person. We have, we've seen, like, little baby more kind of spring-ups, but nothing kind of big and widespread. AGB have not heard anything when it comes to the uh, Kroger's. We actually are still expecting maybe an online drop throughout the next few days or even today for Kroger's, Friend Myers, and Smith's. We have also been seeing a lot of them also up at just in stores in general. So if you just want to go to casually check and see, kind of in the same boat as Myers. It does kind of seem like those kind of mid-tier grocery stores are getting a lot of stock throughout this week, which is always nice to go and see. 
and as well all the other various places like the Belks or say like the Dells or Verizon's Coles, all those places are still on the overdue side, but I do think today will be a little bit more on the chiller laid back in general, besides all the store walking. So be on the lookout for all the stores we mentioned. We'll kind of hopefully have a nice start of our week. We'll do a little bit more on the weekly videos too as well in the next few hours. So be on the lookout for that. I appreciate you guys all so much for watching. Make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. Amazon links down below for the PS5 Disc Digital Console Controller. Twitter and Twitch room down below as well in the Twitter giveaway too. And I appreciate you guys all so much for watching. See you guys all throughout today and check out the weekly video in a little bit.